Many Patagonia days begin under clear, sunny, welcoming skies. But you better make use of the friendly air as the daily freight train is coming. By 2 p.m., it arrives in the form of 90 to 120 plus kilometer an hour winds out on the Pampa. There's no better place for beginner to intermediate fly fishers to travel and catch gullible, ever-willing trout than Patagonia. It's that same howling wind that allows for casting of any level of fly fisher to have a great chance of catching trout. They're used to tree branches and sticks falling into the water, and we've yet to witness such unspookable fish elsewhere. If you can roll or shoot or smack a fly 15 feet of line or more, this is a great place to visit. There's heaps of different beetle species, cicadas, hoppers and other large terrestrials that get blown onto the water. Add freshwater crabs to the available terrestrials, mayflies, caddis and stoneflies and you have a high population of small to medium sized browns and rainbows that are ever willing. The Huemulas River southeast of Koheki is our favorite in the region. It flows through an incredible transition zone between the coastal rainforest to the west and the extreme windswept dry pampa along the Argentine border to the east. The series of stair-step waterfalls and historic lava flows provide a unique ecoregion. The Huemulas alone is worth traveling to Koheki. This day we arrived to find heavy boot tracks in the sand. We knew that quite a few guide days had recently hit this river and when you're late to the party and you know the going style is to smack beetles on the water, you're going to get plenty of refusals or shy and soft eats on your beetle. So let's just get those out of the way, shall we?
Oh, yeah, just, it's basically down the middle of the trench. Yeah. Such a stunning piece of water. And with a beetle down the trench lined with weeds, you know they're seeing it, hearing it, feeling it land, so. I'm just smacking it. <laughs> there he is. There he came back. Nice fish. Gorgeous fish. Just keep your rod low to the edge. And nice, gorgeous brown. Nice fish. Hey, there you go. Good job. That's long. There we go. Gorgeous. Right around to you. And just getting blue now. Nice. Gorgeous. Stunning fish. Beautiful. That's awesome. Just work your way up. You don't always have to be right on them. That's for sure. I think that was the spot I just caught that fish, right? Yep. So I'm going to go just a little wider so I don't spook anybody up in theory. But I'm going to put this right above this little next little pocket with a smack. See if anybody comes up. Again, that still might have been his domain territory, you know. Up in here. Little twitches, little twitches. Now we're gonna try to bring whoever's out from underneath this stuff. Is anybody coming? No. Okay, here we go. Bring him out. Yep, there he is. You knew he was coming. You knew he was coming. And you try to bring him out as fast as you can because there might be a bigger cousin underneath those banks. Gorgeous brown. For a gorgeous little spot and get his head in the water and put him in the basket. Just like that. Wake it, man. Yeah, gorgeous fish. And and belly is full. Oh. But not hard fat. Okay. okay. Yeah. You got that? I sure do. You would think. Right there. Oh yeah. Beauty, beauty, beauty. That's a gorgeous fish, guys. Gorgeous fish. Yep. Gorgeous fish. Very pretty. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I bring them to you, yep. There we go. In the net, in the net. Woo, sorry. Thank you. Right on, man. Look at me here. Look, yeah, I thought so too. <laughs> I thought so too in the water, but it's really pretty colors, eh? Oh. Here we go, love. Round to me. Okay, down, up, go. Yeah, we all thought that was bigger. When, we, when you netted it, I went, oh. Yeah, maybe off the other side here. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go a couple off my left just because I'm here, straight above me. And then I'll go off to my right eventually here. Okay. There we go, and okay, now I'm gonna start to move to my right. Yeah. Yeah, bigger than I think. I didn't think that was big, but it's not big, but it's just healthy. 14, 15 maybe? <laughs> Here he comes. Whee! Yeah. 
Another, another chunky one. Guillermo would be proud of a chunky fish. Oh, 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 oh. There. Got him, yeah. Sweet, man. Gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Eduardo's gonna show it, I think. You go ahead and just let him go up and go. Nice, yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. A chunka. Chunky. Chunky chunka. Off he goes. Yeah, out here. Oh. That's okay, he's going. If he goes, he goes. In this there we go. Yep. <laughs>
is he? Just on the oh, bottom, yeah. orange rock. Yeah. He's just off the big gray rock. Big gray rock? But he's, he's left of it. Leaf. He's left. Leaf. He's this, up by that. Up leaf. here? No, the big leaf above the gray rock on the right. Oh, okay. He's way up there now. Here we go. There. Yeah, I got him. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. That was he still was at me. I really had yeah. to wait on that. God, I had yeah. to wait on that. It's a nice fish. Whoa, 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 at me. Hang on. It's a nice fish. It's not crazy long, but it's just a nice head again. Oh, yeah. Beautiful fish. Yeah, you wanted that beetle again. Really, really shallow water. Yeah, beautiful. Okay. And in the net, yeah, gorgeous. That's a gorgeous fish. <laughs> so wait. Here we go. Up. And up. Yeah, release. And away he goes. Beautiful. Wow. No, no, wait, wait. wait. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Thanks, man. That was awesome. There must be one more. Maybe we need a bigger beetle. One more here for now. Yeah, I'm gonna work. Gotta work this first, don't I? Okay. Short then over. Not that anything. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Saw him come, turn around, leave, come back, turn around and charged at it. There we go. Okay. Leg it. Boy, you'd think so, wouldn't you? He'll show. Yeah, so I waited on that. I saw him coming. I delayed as long as I could, right at me. Yeah, it was right at me. I was like, shit, I gotta wait on that. Yeah. Yeah, it's not huge, but the, the head is big. But he's coming right at me, hey? I was like, oh, I gotta wait, I gotta wait. <laughs> Looks like I waited long enough. That's hard to do when it's coming right at you like that. Still a really nice male. There we go. Gorgeous fish. Just though, hey? It was right at me. It was like, I gotta wait, I gotta wait. <laughs> yeah. I might just do a reveal and release because it's warmer. And not not much current. Okay, here we go, though. Wicked. <laughs> Gorgeous fish. It's not the ice coldest Spring Creek. Sometimes hard to know what the hell to do with this when it's in the air and those gusts come at you. How are you supposed to fish in something that just dumps out of the sky? I'll just put it here. Should be something right up here. Yeah, right over. Right here. Right here, here he comes. And he turned. Uh, no, a different fish, but uh, I just saw him as he went. It's a good, it's a gorgeous fish. Okay, better go for him. You go. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Got him. There you go. And go. Awesome. Ooh, good fish up there. Just rose off that point. Yeah. Dragon fly. That point up there. Is it? 
Okay, so I'm gonna aim it for up in here, okay? Just yeah. kind of off, just in just out from those dead grasses, just downstream of. Let me know when you're ready. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Right there. Yep, nice. Set that up. Set that up. Awesome. He was going to eat. He jumped out of the water after a dragonfly, so that made it easier. Fat. Ah, 18. But fat. <laughs>